My name is Emma and I'm going to show you that it's easier than you think to make a bird feeder. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our plastic bottle and a sharp object. I'm using a pen knife, but you could just use a drawing pin. And we're going to make four small holes, two on one side of our plastic bottle and two on the other. This is so that the twigs can poke right the way through so it gives the little birds something to perch on. So the next thing we're going to do is make our feeding holes. Now I'm going to put these just above the holes that we've already made for the twigs. I'll do it in a very similar way. I'm going to use my pen knife, your sharp object, to make a hole and then I'll use a pair of scissors to make it a bit bigger. Finally, I'm going to poke two more holes in the neck of the bottle. This is where I'm going to poke a piece of twine through so that the bird feeder can hang up. So the next thing to do is to poke our twigs through the holes to make the little perches for the birds. The last thing to do before we can finally fill up our bird feeder with bird food is to loop a bit of twine around the top, poke it through our holes at the top of the bottle so we can use that to hang it on a branch. Now it is time to fill up our bird feeder with some bird food. I just got this bird food in my local supermarket, but really you can just use whatever you can get your hands on, sunflower seeds, mealworms, and to make life a little bit easier, I'm using this little scoop that I got in a box of laundry detergents. So all we have to do now is hang it up. Make sure you find somewhere quite high up and sheltered to protect it from predators. 